Godzilla Destroy All Monsters Melee is an action-packed Godzilla fighting game that was released in 2002. This game sees you taking control of one of the 11, 12 if you're playing the Japanese version, kaiju and face off against other Godzilla characters in a number of modes with surprisingly in-depth movesets and really impressive destructible environments. There were two other Godzilla games released after this one, Save the Earth and Godzilla Unleashed. I remember more about those other two, but I grew up with all three, so I'm right at home with these games. This is an all-time classic and a fan favorite, so I'm excited to show it off today. Let's get into it. Godzilla, destroy all monsters. Melee. Classic. Welcome to Godzilla Destroy All Monsters Melee, one of the greatest Godzilla games ever made. So first off, I want to apologize I haven't uploaded in a little bit. I've been sick recently getting over that. My voice is all messed up. Two great Godzilla movies have come out recently, so I figured what better time to take a look at these games. I'm going to go into the adventure mode, basically the equivalent of this game's campaign. Adventure mode. Pretty good selection of monsters in this game. I don't really have any unlocked. I played the 90s campaign for a video that I'm planning to drop on my other channel, so be on the lookout for that, but I don't really want to rehash it, so I'm going to play my main man Godzilla 2000 yeah. for this video, which his face kind of looks interesting in this game, I don't know. What? Yep, let's get into it. Attention inhabitants of the planet you call Earth. We are the Vortex. Right. Alien invaders from a distant galaxy. We oh, that's have nice. Come to seize control of your planet and plunder its resources for our own purposes. It's what we do. <laughs> to encourage your cooperation, we have seized control of your monster island facility and have unleashed all monsters under our mind control rays. Not even your strongest monster can break free of our control and defeat the others. That is all. Am I still on? Oh. Uh, well, we now return you to whatever it was you were doing. Idiots. I can resume my Family Guy funny moments. One of the coldest loading screens I've ever seen. Godzilla 2000 versus King Ghidorah. Monsters. Fight. Come here. Let me remember how to play. Take this. Oh, the scale of these games is so great. Just walk through a building and it crumbles. Oh. Ooh, what's this? Huh? I'm Super Saiyan Godzilla, come here. Oh. I wonder how many people are dying just in this casual monster scuffle that's going on here. Look at those little cars, these people just on their way to work. What is this? Oh! I'm super powered, come here. Wow, these movements are a little bit fluid for uh, 7 billion pound monsters. Whoa! Whoa! That's not cool. There could be only one king of the monsters. So yeah, this game is pretty chaotic, it kind of just throws you right into the action without even telling you what to do. That's part of the charm though, I would say. Monsters. Fight. Megalon is conveniently attacking Los Angeles. It's probably the least weird thing to ever happen in Los Angeles. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. He's a force to be reckoned with. Come on. I love the environmental destruction in this game. Look, you can just destroy these buildings if you really want to. Whoa, Megalon, I'm trying to make an example. Megalon, I would appreciate if you stopped doing that. Wow, he is super strong. What is that, Mothra? What is this? Mothra, airstrike. Help me, Mothra. Oh no, oh no. Oh, that was a fierce battle. Tokyo, alright. Godzilla's coming home. Anguirus. 
monsters. Fight. Well, why is Smog Monster flying? Okay, that was weird. Since when did Tokyo have green barriers put up everywhere? Ah! Angelus, you stubbed my toe. I'll never forgive you for this. I need this power up. All right, don't worry. Just gonna. Uh, trample a few dozen apartment buildings on my way over there. I would never kill anybody on purpose. I'm a good citizen. Did I mention this game came out in 2002? Look at these destructible environments. Poor Angelus. Look guys, I saved the city. Monsters. Fight. I love Gigan. Ow! Okay, friendship officially ended with Gigan. Oh my gosh, you see these combos? I'm a Godzilla professional. I know all the Godzilla moves. Come on, me and Mothra got this. Easy. I'm untouchable. A city has been unlocked. Really, did I unlock this map? By beating him? That's pretty cool. Back when you could unlock stuff by playing the game instead of having to pay $5 for it. Monster Island is under attack. Damn. Monsters. Fight. Oh boy. Rodan. This isn't you. You've been mind controlled. Take a rock. That should get it out of your system. Okay, it's gonna take a little more than that, I see. Rodan, I have tons of- Ow. You're destroying our home. Rodan, you're always an idiot. Just- you have to stand out from the masses. Don't let yourself be controlled by some aliens. Maybe this will knock some sense into him. The old Godzilla special. The movement is so fluid you almost forget most of these movies are people in rubber suits fighting. He's stuck in there. It's like a prison. Here, get out. I got something for you. Nope. That's what I thought. Take that. Oh my gosh, that was tedious. I don't know why Rodan was so powerful out of every monster that could have... Literally, I beat King Ghidorah in like 5 seconds in Rodan. That was crazy. This game is just unpredictable like that sometimes, I guess. I have fond memories of playing the versus mode. When I was in like 3rd grade, we had a game day where people brought all their own consoles and stuff, and I played this. It was so much fun. London. We're, we're gonna play as British Godzilla? Do you honestly think- Destroyer! Monsters! Fight! I never knew Destroyer was British. I guess he does have that kind of look about him. It would probably be more fitting to fight Destroyer if I was playing as 90s Godzilla. Whoa! No idea what just happened there. Oh, is that a Mothra? Here. Yeah. Mothra, help me, you're just sitting there. I'm stuck. Get out of my way. British orphanage. Take this. Whoa, I didn't even know you could pick those buildings up. Too easy. Ooh, you see that uppercut? I know you saw that uppercut. San Francisco. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Monsters. Fight. The rematch of the century. Did I seriously just blast him into the health pickup? Oh, I need this. Did I just see- I just saw Hedera flying in the sky again. Yeah, what? You can't make this up. What is that? No. Okay, well, the world is over. I might as well just give up. My old adversary. Uh-oh. Ow. How do you think the people in those buildings feel when they get thrown at Godzilla at like 700 miles per hour? Those poor people. Maybe they're on board with it, actually. Uh, who knows? Oh, no, you don't. I see. He's running towards that health. This is mine. No, you lost. Again. Nope. You're not winning this one. KO. 
О. Man, King Ghidorah is always a fierce opponent. Your monster has proven to be a worthy adversary, but it is of no consequence. We are now prepared to unleash our ultimate monster. But first, permit me to offer a little demonstration of its awesome power. Engage teleportation beam. And now we will see who is king of the monsters. I actually can't remember who the final boss of this game is. Godzilla 2000 versus Mecha Godzilla Monsters. I could have sworn it was Orga. It's Mecha Godzilla 2. Ow! Why did he stub my toe? That's actually really cool seeing Godzilla 2000 fighting Mecha Godzilla 2. Because that's not really something that would happen. I know Kiryu was in the Japanese version of this game and maybe the Xbox version, but I'm playing this on a GameCube emulator, so don't have access to him. Even though I love Kiryu, he's really amazing. Actually, I think the American cover of this game is Godzilla 2000 versus Mecha Godzilla 2, so it's pretty cool. Ooh, health. Health, please. He's too far away from me. The camera will not advance to let me get health. That's actually really frustrating. All right, I have to play this safe. I need to throw something. But there is nothing that I can pick up. Come on. This is such a close fight. You can only pick up certain buildings for some reason. It's weird. Run. Please stop chasing me. Ow. Ow. You're done. Oh, that was so close. I got him, though. We just got teleported away. A new monster has been discovered. Really? I actually haven't seen that before. Maybe I unlocked somebody to play as in this mode. Oh wait, did I beat it? I could have sworn that Orga was the final boss. See, look at that. My two top scores. Probably because I'm the only human who's playing on this safe file. Well, that's nice. Let's see what this new monster is all about. Oh, I unlocked Destroya. Okay, that's pretty cool. Maybe I'll make a follow-up to this if you want to see me play as any of these other monsters, because, I mean, I don't know. I'm more of a Godzilla guy myself, but Destroya could be fun. There's also these other modes like Survival, Melee, Team Battle, Destruction. I don't really know much about those. Be sure to like the video, comment, and subscribe so you don't miss a future upload. I hope you enjoyed that nostalgia trip. This is a really, really classic game. I love this. I'll be sure to revisit Save the Earth next, because I kind of have more memories with that one, but, I mean, these are all pretty similar games to each other. But yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Catch you in the next one.